I think for me, faith is probably at the centre of everything that I do. I'd probably say it's the main thing that I care about and worry about in terms of my life in general and that it chunks rugby by quite a way. My family believed that we wouldn't be here if it wasn't for what we believed in, uh, the opportunities that we've been given, uh, the talents that me and my brother have. I think for us it was something that we centred our lives around and gave us a real purpose. It's something that we, don't, that we tend not to talk about. It's not taboo, but it's just, you know, it's, it's my little thing that I have, um, something that I cherish. Um, and like I said, sometimes I don't always um, act or behave like I should as a Christian. Rush or slow off that scrum, which means Fulipala gets a charge directly at Evans. I was upset and sometimes it is all right to get angry. I, I think it is, and, but you must ask for forgiveness and being kind, uh, selflessness and honest. Um, all those traits are hard in our, in our environment, you know, because you always want to get an edge Shot. in rugby. <laughs> Here goes Billy Vodapola. He's going for the try line, and there's no doubt about that one. Vodapola powers off the back of... I think the biggest thing for people with faith um, coming into a, a rugby environment is, um, and the Bible talks about this, is don't judge others. Uh, there are people who are always going to do their own thing, and that's fine, but, you know, sometimes you probably did something worse or are doing something worse, and yet you're standing there judging them. Um, and once you get past that stage, you will accept everyone for who they are and in turn they'll do the same. And it's not about coming in and, you know, it's taken me a while to be comfortable to talk about it, but as soon as I did, I kind of just, my rugby just took off. The second half, that power game and Billy Bonapola is the man. I always say a prayer before the game, um, you know, when I'm walking onto the pitch and taking the air in and it's more like a thank you that I get to do what I do. It's such a cool experience and when I do say my prayer, my heart's probably racing at, I don't know, 95% of my max, but it's all excitement and nervous energy as well, but nervous energy is good. My faith probably helps me a lot more to be a lot more relaxed, especially during the build-up, the games, um, not to worry about things, not to worry about winning or losing. Um, because I know that it keeps everything in perspective. You know, there, there are other people out there who are way worse off than me. And I'm just here trying to win a rugby game and that's it, you know. So I'm not here trying to pray for a victory. I'm just praying for energy and, and strength and support. And whatever happens, happens. And sometimes I might cry after losing, but that's probably just me. It's there for Wigglesworth. It's there! Just come in, um, be who you are, let other people be who they are and through your actions show them that um, your, your faith is something that you truly believe in. And rugby is such an accepting environment um, that people uh, will love you no matter what.